welcome to that Iowa homestead. Today, we're over by my broccoli in my container garden area. And just this morning, I discovered that I'm currently fighting a losing battle with some worms. Here, I try to do things as organically as possible. I've only been gardening for about three years. I've still got a lot to learn, um, but I've come a long way from when I first started, that is for sure. So, when I discovered these worms on my broccoli this morning, I panicked. I did. And I thought, well, if I can find something to get rid of these organically, I will. If not, I'll resort to using maybe some seven dust. But luckily, um, at one of the local nurseries around here, I found some BT, which is an organic method for getting rid of caterpillars. So I thought I'd bring you along for this journey and let you know like what my thoughts are on it because this is this will be the first time that I've had to battle caterpillars. So the directions on the little bottle of BT said to mix anywhere from half a teaspoon to four teaspoons per gallon. So I just went ahead and went full strength. Got my little sprayer here. Let's get going. So I got my sprayer here. I got it all pumped up and ready to go. I'm going to try to coat each leaf as possible. So my understanding of how BT is going to work is that BT is an organic compound. It's naturally found in the soil. And when a caterpillar consumes the BT, it starts right away attacking the gut of the caterpillar. And um, within a few hours, it's going to stop eating. And then within a couple of days, it's going to die. Hopefully within a couple of hours, they'll stop damaging my broccoli back there. And then within a couple of days, no more caterpillars. And I'll probably spray BT again here in a couple of days just to make sure that I got them all. Um, probably continuously do that for like a couple of weeks just to make sure because they've already taken a significant amount of damage back there I don't want them to take any more damage so I'm gonna do what I can to kind of protect them and I'm glad that I found a uh, organic solution to this I'm gonna check back with you guys in a couple of days and let you know how it worked hey guys it's the following day about 8 30 in the morning and I'm just coming out to check to see what the update is see what's going on over here so yesterday when I was checking out these broccolis I could pretty much pick a leaf and find a caterpillar today I'm not seeing as much I'm still seeing a couple but I mean to me those look dead so fingers crossed that that took care of my caterpillar problem let's check out these ones over here I still see a couple that one on the right looks like it's still alive. But like I said, I do plan on spraying again. In a couple of days, I will spray one more time. Just to make sure. That one definitely looks dead. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So far, I'm pretty happy with the results. I'm not really seeing a ton of action out here. Hopefully, they're all gone. All right, friends. It has been two days since, no, it's been three days since I sprayed my broccoli plants with BT. And I'm over here checking them out right now. I wanted you to come check them out with me. As I'm checking out all these leaves, remember, when we were here before, you could pretty much pick a leaf and spot a caterpillar. Now, I'm gonna say I do not see any evidence of caterpillars right now. But I do see a little broccoli head. Oh, it looks so good. Yeah, I'm not seeing any, any signs of caterpillars at all. No poop, no freshly chewed up leaves. As a matter of fact, all I'm seeing really is new growth here, which is fantastic. I do see this little garden spidey here though. That's good. Eat those bugs, spidey. 
I'm very happy with the BT that I used. I think it's working phenomenally. I think it worked phenomenally. It took care of my caterpillar problem fast and it saved my broccoli plants. Thank you for coming with me today. I'll see you soon.